Okay guys, so right now the internet computer ICP price is hovering near a critical support zone and in this video we will be talking about what we could expect for the ICP price in the next couple of hours or days and also discuss the recent price action, what are the important price levels to account for, the possible scenarios in the short term and long term and much more. So you definitely would want to miss this update video I have right now for the internet computer ICP price. So let us begin inside the four hourly time frame charts and then later on in the video we'll move to the longer time frames but right now in the four hourly time frames as you guys can see recently we had this sharp red candle towards the downside and that is because you guys can see we broke below this trend line recently which was a support trend line we broke below it and then what happened here is that we had a retest of this trend line and got ultimately rejected right here and therefore we have seen this sharp red candle towards the downside but now it seems like the price is starting to recover a bit in the four hourly time frames so now let's move to the longer daily time frames and discuss my current view or outlook so if you take a look into the daily time frame charts pretty much nothing has changed in my view and the chart as a matter of fact still looks pretty intact because if we zoom out you guys can see the next support level is right here the sad news though is we broke below the support on um, this support trend line you guys can see recently we discussed this in my previous video icp broke below this trend line so this is a support level that we have recently lost therefore in the next couple of hours i am expecting icp to find support around this range or this zone right here and that is starting at 11.4 dollars and it goes down until 10.5 dollars so i am expecting this support zone to of course support the price so if ever we do see icp move down in the in the next couple of hours i'm expecting this zone to support the price and ultimately see that price bounce towards the upside now yeah in the next couple of hours or days i'm still expecting that the price action could be boring for icp especially and for many other altcoins out there because right now bitcoin is still having some choppy price action therefore we may expect altcoins, some altcoins to bleed harder or to just have continue having this boring price action. And for ICP, I'm expecting that we could just pretty much move sideways in the next couple of days between support and resistance. You guys can see I have marked the important support and resistance levels. Right here we have resistance and right here we have support. And what I'm expecting the next couple of days is that we could see pretty much ICP move sideways between support and resistance between this corridor right here so the only time i would start to get worried or concerned is once we do see icp lose this support zone right here because that could that could mean that we could see icp move down towards the next level at 8.6 dollars so in order for that to not happen we must hold this blue zone at all costs and we must stay ten we must stay above 10.5 dollars so as long as we are above 10.5 dollars there is nothing pretty concerning at the moment and nothing worries me now let us move to the longer weekly time frames and discuss what is my current outlook in the long term am i bearish or am i bullish for icp right now you guys are gonna find out so as you guys can see the price action has been pretty boring for the past couple of weeks or months you can see that since the, the month of january we have been moving sideways with no interesting or significant price action we have been moving within this corridor between support and resistance for the past couple of months and i'm expecting this pattern or this setup to continue if bitcoin continues to print in this choppy price action we could pretty much expect icp to move within this range between support and resistance that ranges from around 11 dollars until 15 dollars this is the range to look out for in the next couple of days or weeks and eventually though eventually we can't keep putting in this price action for too long i believe that at some point eventually we will see icp have that ultimate break above resistance and once we do see once we do see that happen for icp that is bullish mode confirmed because now we could proceed towards the next target of around 23 dollars right here which is the next target for the next leg towards the upside so this is a target once we do see icp successfully break above this resistance zone and flip that to support 
The next target is $23. And then if we zoom out, you can see we have more targets right here. We have $36. Next, we have $54 and then $81. These are the targets to look out for. It's displayed on the screen. These are my respective bull run targets. And keep in mind, as the bull run continues, I will be adjusting or I'll be setting new targets respectively for ICP. So at the moment, I'm not getting shaken out. I believe in the altcoins that I hold. And I just see this, this dip we are in right now. I see this as another opportunity to load up on high conviction altcoins and fortify or position ourselves wisely for the upcoming bull run. I believe that we have not topped up yet. I believe that this is just a temporary correction or a pullback that we all need before the next leg towards the upside. So if you're asking about my current outlook or game plan, at the moment, I am not worried. Yes, I am down bad in my investments, but this does not affect my emotions and I stick to the game plan that I'm holding for pretty much the rest of the year. And once you do see Bitcoin have that parabolic run towards the upside, that is when I'm planning to take profits respectively on my altcoins as well. So that is the quick update. If you find if you have received value from this video, drop a like. And for your information, we are approaching one of the biggest bull runs of our life. And if you are serious about making life changing wealth in this market, you can no longer do this alone. You need a group of people. You need that network of people who would supply you with value, who would supply you information and who would help you spot opportunities in this market. And that can only be accessed in my private networking group over discord this is called a swan group where i release weekly market insights and updates the reason why our members are growing rapidly is because all we do is provide value with one another and help each other elevate in this market so if you are not in this group yet you are missing out so be sure to join through the link in the description and act now